Good evening and welcome back once again. So today we are away to Real Betis. It's the final match of this calendar year in the league and we're ahead by nine points at the moment. So hopefully another three points today. Quite a few changes. I'm not going to go through them all, but as you can see, lots of flashing ups. Yeah, let's hope we get a good game. So let's hope we can finish 2022 on a high in the game. Obviously in real life, we're, what is it now? Middle of June in 2023. Yeah, this will be the last match of the calendar year in 2022. Obviously, about halfway through the season, there are thereabouts. Top of the league, through to the knockout stages of the Champions League, still in the Copa del Rey. And um, we'll have to wait and see what sort of uh, youth players are going to come through, what sort of regens. See if there's anyone that we're fancy uh, purchasing or bringing up from the youth squad. Could we potentially make any signings of any standard players? Uh, probably not. We've only got about 10 million transfer funds, which isn't really going to get us anyone. Um, I'm really thinking of regens at the moment. We've got such a great, not only first 11, but squad now. It's not like we really need to strengthen it, but I want to bring that youth through as well. Comfortable save there from Schubert, but yeah, quite a lot of players on ups today. Including this guy, GRB, he's on a flashing up. Here he is, nice play there. Oh, Nelly got through to Castro. Castro's improved a lot lately as well because he was on that flashing up for quite a significant time. The flashing up where you're actually improving rather than the sort of Derby flashing ups, which I think today is. Um, Yes, he's, what is he, 76 weighted now, I think. Very good. Plays a lot higher, I think, than his uh, actual rating. Good tackle there. Not good from Castro there, though. He's only so good at holding up the ball. This is more like it. Diaby's certainly going to be an outlet today. Now Herrera. Diaby again. Castro. Oh, it deflects. Can Diaby keep it in? No, and the defence somehow very calmly play it out. The AI are way too good at that. Like all teams, it's uh, it's crazy. Mudrick. Now Castro. Mudrick again. Castro. 1 0. Great move there. 1 2 between Mudrick and Castro. Great passing. You can see Castro backing into the defender there, giving him a bit of space. Nice touch and finish. Yeah, lovely turn. Excellent strike. It's what you expect from Castro, though. He's so lethal at finishing. Holding up the ball is one of his strengths as well. Gets him now, winning the ball back. Gets it back. Castro uh, tries to play to Diaby. Maybe they're trying to be a bit too clever there. Herrera. Oh, he just loses out. It just bobbled up. The wrong time. And they get a little bit fortunate there with the... Uh, May the ball bounce. Lee Kangin wins it back, though. Good work from him. Now DRB. Mudrick. Oh, nearly a good ball through to Castro. Very good spot. And it's just the last defender getting the interception. It's a pretty open game so far. Good tackle from Debussy. Couldn't quite keep it in, but tackle was the main thing there. Ah, goes out again. Want to get that second goal, though, to be a little bit more comfortable. Good tackle from Debussy. Still don't get it back, though.
Take share of the youngster starting in left back today. That's poor. Straight at the uh, the opposition. Good tackle. Nice play by Herrera. Really nice play by Kang and Lee to Diaby. Oh, good reaction from the keeper. It was a snapshot. Come on, Debushi, what are you doing? He just he was like stuck in mud there. I don't know what was going on. I could pay for that here. I don't know. Debushi's had a, bit, a few moments of. Uh, I'm not quite sure what. Needs to settle down. Anyway, got the ball back there. Poor from Herrera. Right, Diaby now. Now Castro. Mudrick. That's poor. And that's half time. 1 0. Could it be more? I really feel like that first half, although we've got the lead, it was a little bit of a missed opportunity. We really should have had. I don't want that. There's another sloppy pass. Too many sloppy passes. That's what's done it. See, the goal itself we scored was very good. Um, but not enough quality for the rest of the match so far. Nicely played to Mudruk there. And he is PC. Oh. Kang and Lee has deflected. Unlucky there. It's, <laughs> could have gone anywhere and it's went behind everyone. That's over. Difficult head. He had two defenders on him. And Mudruk's not what you'd say the most prolific in the air. Gets in. Oh, Diaby got blocked there. I don't know how he didn't get past the defender. Ah, unlucky. Just bounced off him. It's not going away. I don't know why. Ah, oh, come on, ref man. I hate these referees. I'm so used to this on these games. Just beyond the RB. Gets in. Castro. That's not who I was playing it to. I was playing it to um, Mudrick on the left there. And it's try to pass it to the wrong player. Dear me, this is a. Uh, it's frustrating this game. Better play. Now DRB. Castro. I don't know what that was. Terrible pass. Castro, 2-0, and that's more like it. Mudrick and Castro combine again. OK, 
again Herrera involved out to Mudrig Castro lovely touch but it's that finish there keep a stud no chance defender probably blocking his view a little bit first touch left foot finish great work there we'll make some subs now as well Okay, so we're going to bring on Carlos Perez for Kang and Lee and actually playing him that attack midfield central role. Put up Martinelli up top for Ruben Castro and Mudrick's going to come off for Bellarabi on the left. Of course, Martinelli, uh, <laughs> what a player to be able to bring on. Only 20 minutes to go. It's been a strange all game. We've been, you know, the dominant team sloppy sloppy passing some great moves some terrible <laughs> terrible passing like that so it's definitely been a bit of a mixed bag I'd like to get a third if we can aye, aye, aye. referee just gives so many soft free kicks just 50-50 clashes. Oh, here's the bushy. Morinelli, who's pretty quick. No DRB. Diaby deflects that'll be a corner. Just couldn't really find the space there. Um, yeah, might as well have Carlos Perez take it. I've got our usual set piece takers on. Oh, that should have been a goal. I think it was the central defender. Really nice play, Carlos Perez. Oh, so close to three. Really nice play, though. That's more like it. They got caught there. Got a little bit lucky. What is going on here? Here's Mortnelli. Now DRB. Mortnelli. Oh, really nice play. 3-0, classy goal, great little 1-2 between Martinelli and Diaby. And the sub strikes, back to goal, nice little pass around, but it's this 3-ball here. Bisects 3 defenders. And the finish is pretty simple from that range. Probably looking a little bit more comfortable now. Really what it should have been. You can just never tell how a game's going to work out. You know, all these players on ups and been in great form and it just haven't quite flowed as normal. I mean, it's still 3 0, but uh, definitely not at our best. Nice play again, though. But I don't know what happened there. Don't know how Monty didn't get on that. Bella Robbie maybe. Yes. Now Martinelli. Diaby. Perez. Ah, oh, it's a shocking ball. Why didn't I just go for goal? Don't know what I was thinking there. Just overthinking it. Should have went with an instinct and just try to finish it. Would have been a really nice flow and move as well to finish the game. Be one more chance though. Oh, nice play to Carlos Perez again. Giobi, where are you going? I was in there. 
But there it is, full time. Castro with a double and Martinelli the sub with a goal. Castro man a match, not a surprise. Front three doing a good job. And the subs did pretty well when coming on as well, especially Martinelli with that goal. And that's it for today, guys. The next match will be against Mallorca in the league. And then we're away to Cadiz in the Copa del Rey. But obviously before that, the transfer window is opening. So I'll let you know if there's any updates in terms of any youth signings, regens, anything like that. But join me then, hit that like button, drop a comment down below and subscribe to the channel if you're not already. And I'll see you next time. Cheers.